I'm not really sure how I got picked to do this, but Columbia told me to test out some of their gear, and I got to pick it. So of course I picked a hat that has a brown trout pattern, so I have an idea for the video. Catch a brown trout. I went fishing in Milwaukee and in Port Washington because the only places you can fish for brown trout in Wisconsin in the month of November is Lake Michigan or Lake Michigan tributaries. The rivers that are inland are off limits. The hike bound jacket I got is waterproof so I had to test that in the rain. And then the fleece as well, it's just a nice fleece so I wore that when I went to the Milwaukee River. Let's get to fishing. Look at those waves. Look at those waves. Usually I could go out on that retaining wall and fish. And I could fish in here a little bit too. In this intake pond, but I can't go out there today. Also, the water is real muddy here. And the big waves made it not clear. That's why I'm using a chartreuse spinner. So I'm going to fish an area I never fish, which is the actual discharge. Look at this. Dude, surfers could be out here today. It is rough. This is some rough weather, baby. It's crazy right now. I'm um, hot. It's 40 degrees and raining, and I'm hot right now. Dude, this, this is such a cool hat. I can't even get it in a frame. Where's my hat? There. Ah, that's cool. Jacket. It's just kicking butt. The hat is so cool. On day one of this mission, I went specifically because it was a really ugly day. Usually there's a ton of people by the discharge, and I believe it was a Packer game at this time, and it was raining, and it was cold, so I actually got to fish by it. I put down some floating spawn sacks, and I also was casting around a crankbait and a spinner and a jerk bait and i just couldn't catch any fish then i actually had to leave because you can only fish for a half hour after it gets dark at this point so day one was a fail columbia gear by the way it's awesome it's really nice i don't think columbia cares if i catch a fish or not but i wanted to put the stuff to the test and show off a brown trout with my brown trout hat. I'm making a video no matter what out of this. The full length video is happening. I got so many good drone shots. I got so much good like steady shots. I can't help it if the sea is angry. I can't help that. I can't help if the water is murky. I can't help it if the brown trouts look at my lure but don't bite it. All right, let's go. What was really cool is I got out and then the skies actually kind of cleared. So I got a really cool orange sunrise on this day. But guess what? I could not find the brown trout. There are a few in the harbor. I saw some jumping. I only saw one boat driving around trying to catch fish. There were several people by the discharge, but I didn't see anybody catching fish by the discharge either. I tried all around the intake pond. I went out as far as I could on the wall. I cast into the big sea. I cast into the harbor. I even went by the docks and put some spawn sacks on the bottom there and cast around there too. Just could not find the brown trout. I gave up with Port Washington. I went down to Milwaukee to fish the Milwaukee River in the hopes that I could land one with a spinner. Most people in Milwaukee like to float fish. I'm not good at it, nor do I have like brown trout eggs to use. So I battle with the trees and the rubbish and try and catch brown trout and all the brambles. And right away, I caught a tree. It was great. Oh, you got to be kidding me. <laughs> it was worth it. <laughs> it 
No, I... <laughs> I got snagged up on a tree. <laughs> yeah. That's a smallie. Uh, I was like, it looks deeper here, so I don't want to go in. But I thought I would have scared everything. <laughs> well, I know, but that's where the people float fish, so I don't want to interrupt that, you know? <laughs> Look at that. That is awesome. <laughs> You gotta love smallmouth. I was surprised they're still hanging around. It's been cold, but not too cold. We're getting down to the 30s at night, and then it's still hitting 50s in the day, so some smallmouth still in the river. I just kept battling, looking for places that I could cast into the river where there wasn't other float fishermen. I don't like to interrupt those guys because they drift a lot of the river, and I don't want to cross lines with them. Maybe someday I'll learn how to do it. I know there's people like Seth, who I've fished before with that absolutely crushed steelhead and brown trout doing that but I'm just happy casting around right now oh there we go Hey, little guy. Yeah. What's up? There it is. We got one. I can still catch fish. Let's go. We got a brown trout. Huh? Just nicked him. There he is. There he goes. Nice, nice. All right, you be the judge. That's cool. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> I gotta get a shot of that. Finally happened. You got a little brown. Look at that pattern. Look at my hat. We did it. <laughs> Look at that guy. It's so beautiful. All right. I think I need to wash my hat. <laughs> this didn't look so nasty before. I was just doing a lot of bushwhacking to get the fish. You ever seen this spinner from MEPS? Airforce.com MEPS spinner. Smalley, nice. All right, I'm gonna get. Oh, he's right in the lip. Arr, got you, got you. Look at this. I gotta show off this lure real quick. This was given to me by a student. D gave me this. Look at this. Air Force. Ugh. An Air Force Maps spinner. Airforce.com Maps spinner. You got me a smallie, buddy. All right. Oh, that is pretty. Gosh, is that pretty? Look at that guy. The pattern on that guy. So cool. All right, buddy. You're free to go. <laughs> there he goes. Man, I need a shave. <laughs> yeah, the brown trout hat. With it on, I actually caught a brown trout. Yeah, thanks again, Columbia, for the gear. 
my clothes are awesome. I mean, I already bought Columbia stuff, but now I'm getting Columbia stuff. What is going on in this life? Good things, I guess. Yeah, that was sweet. Also, thanks, Steve, for the Air Force MEP spinner. That caught me a fish, too. You want to see when I had the biggest brown trout of my life, a huge one on a spinner. Click that link. Otherwise, thanks for watching. See ya!